Welcome to our calming, peaceful, better Minecraft world. Almost too peaceful, so I think we should spice things up today and go to the modded nether for the first time. But I think our first step is gearing up to prepare for that because right now we have unenchanted iron. But we just got fortune three on our pickaxe so we can go down to the mines and get some more diamonds. And then hopefully use them to get enchanted diamond armor. We have already found somewhere down here one or two lots of diamonds that we can go get. I think one is down here. I usually mark them with a torch on the ground. Yes, okay. So we've got one, two. Is that all? Oh. Huh. Yeah, I think that is it, sadly. And it only gave us two diamonds. What is the point in fortune? That is so unlucky, but we also have some down here. Hopefully with a bit better luck. It's at least three. Okay, well at least we got five from that, so a total of seven. But I'm gonna keep on mining until we have enough for some more armor. Oh my gosh, wait, what? Is this the same vein? Or is it like two next to each other? They weren't connected. It's at least four. Six for a total of 27. Okay, our luck is turning around. This is good. There's a bunch of skeletons near me. I wonder if we've hit a spawner. I can't tell exactly where it is. Somewhere over here. Oh. Oh. Oh, yep. That's a spawner room. Oh, can they all just kill each other? Please. We're going to have to get in there to get the spawner. Light it up. Is there just one left? Hello. This room is cool. Very spooky. Wait, I think I can see on the mini map the noise I heard. I don't think it's a enemy. Hello? It's a little guy. His name's Joey. I've heard about these guys. What is this? Oh, turtle egg. Wait, don't go. I'm not done with you. That's actually a really good deal. I don't think we need any of these others. Thank you though, Joey. Good luck to you in the caves here. I hope you survive. I guess we could take the string. What's that? Flakes. We have that too. Oh, let's go. There's a diamond in the entrance that we missed. Looking at our mini map though, okay, this is a bit of a detour, but it looks like there's a weird, is it a room over here? It doesn't look like the other caves. Let's go over there. It doesn't seem to have any mobs in it either. Oh, here we go. This is something. Ooh, we have a chest. We have an upstairs. And some barrels. What is that sound? <gasps> what was that? Was there a trap? I'm so confused. Okay, I would like to leave now. I ended up finding a spider spawner and another vein of diamonds before heading back up. I was hoping for about a stack of diamonds total and we got 63, so that is perfect. Let's craft up some armor. So we'll have pants, little booties, a helmet, and a chest plate. And that still leaves us for 39 for spares or combining. Let's see. Actually, the helmet is not really the priority because I picked up this gold helmet, which has some good stuff on it. So we can use that for the nether. Okay, yeah, let's start with this. Ooh. Then we're no longer level 30, so we'll block a couple of shelves. And we can get, oh, feather falling four. I actually feel like that's pretty handy for the nether. We sort of need to level up before doing any more. We also got a random music disc. I feel like we can spare one diamond to make a jukebox. It could go at our little campfire area. Oh, it's like a kind of jazzy tune. Wait, this is cool. I'm not gonna play much more of it though because I'm scared of copyright. But I will definitely be vibing to that later while resource collecting. Next, we're going to head down the river to our spot where we've got some obsidian to collect a little bit more and make a nether portal. We already have some, but I want kind of a big nether portal. Also, this river ride is so pretty. I love it. Here it is, and this time we have efficiency, so it should go a little faster. Okay, we have 36 obsidian and I was thinking of building the portal somewhere over here. So far everything we've done is on this side of the river, but I want to make use of this side as well. The side's very yellow, but I like it. Maybe we'll go back over here a little? I don't know, let's just clear some trees. 
Okay, yeah, I think here will be fine. I don't want to be too precious about placement. So we'll just put it down. 36 blocks would mean we could do nine wide and nine tall. This will absolutely be the biggest near the portal I've ever made, but why not? It's a bit of fun. Oh yeah, okay, I think this looks cool and it'll eventually look really good once we've decorated it. But first I want to actually try going in the nether. So we've got our flint and steel. And I guess I just kind of get right in there. We've got our gold on, we've got a sword. I even brought a random bow with 14 arrows. So this is as good as it's gonna get. Hopefully we come out somewhere good. Okay, this is a bad sign. Oh, 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 things are happening. Oh, no, we're not in a fortress, are we? Okay, we're in a fortress. This is bad. Or is it? There doesn't seem to be anything dangerous around. Oh. Oh, there's things. It's a blaze. No, I don't want it. We didn't even bring a shield. I'm not prepared. Ow. Did it drop? <gasps> it dropped blaze rods. Oh, hello. I really feel like we are being thrown into fire here. Like the advancement. It's like we enter the nether and there's immediate action. We're going to have to mark our portal though. I feel like I'm going to lose this. Also, this fortress is in a crazy biome. What is this? It's all jungly. Oh gosh. Okay. Why am I withered or something? <gasps> no. No. Okay, that would be why. This place is terrifying. I'm glad we armored up before coming in. It could have been really bad. Oh no, no. We don't really have enough arrows for this. I think our plan will be to not go where the blaze are. Look at these mushrooms though. Can we have them? <gasps> we can. Wait, did we get it? Yeah, we did. Wool red mushroom. I want more. We can use these at our base. They'll be so cute. Oh, we lost one. Oh, I can't just chill. Oh, there's two of you. All I'm trying to do is see if the mushrooms can go on here. Oh, they can. That is adorable. What I'm a little less into is these giant eyeballs. These look like they might be kind of bad. Do they hurt you? Yes. Okay. Oh, they hurt you quite a lot. Oh, what are you? Are you okay? Uh, what was that? Was that a fairy? We've also got these cool mushrooms. Oh, and these plants. I don't know if they require silk touch. Um, I don't know. How do we get you? Oh, did it give us slime? Oh, everything's getting kind of pink. This must be a different biome, I assume. There's some blaze over here, but there's also some bones. I will take some bones. Are you through there? You can't get me. Haha. Uh -huh. It looks like we are not going to have any problem getting enough blaze rods for the end. Maybe that could be a little mission right now. We could just go for it. Oh, oh, there's a few of these. Maybe I shouldn't have run right in there. Oh, it's hard to run away because the vines make you go slow. Oh, is this a staircase? Can we go down more into the fortress? Is that a thing? The staircase is very long. Oh, hello. Of course there's a blaze. This is kind of the end of the fortress on this side though. Is it weird that I'm scared to leave the fortress? We have no idea what's out there. What's in the chest? Uh, not a lot. Um, we might actually have to leave the saddle because we're running out of room. Oh, where are you? Over there. No. Okay, well we have 19 blaze rods and a very full inventory. Oh, excuse me? What was that? Okay, I wanna go home. I don't wanna be here anymore. I don't even know what that was. Okay, um, there's blaze. I'm gonna find the portal. And we are back with a bunch of random nether plants and things. We all know I'm very excited about these red mushrooms. We also have a brown one. I definitely want some of these on our house. Oh my gosh, this elevates everything. We're bringing all the cottage core vibes. Oh my gosh, it's so cute on the trees. We only have three, we need more of this. We'll put one here, maybe, and then on this tree. Oh, and we have one brown one. Let's put that here. Then we have glowstone pile. What are these? I don't know. Blooming vines. Maybe these would be cute somewhere. Ooh. Okay, they're cool, but it doesn't quite go. 
Jungle moss. I don't know what this is. Oh, okay. That's also kind of fun. Jellyfish mushroom sapling, but we don't have the stuff it says it needs to survive. Some of it's just a regular nylium. If we get some touch, we could get some of it and grow some of these. We also have golden vines. Oh, these are cool. They give off light, I think. I want to grow some of this somewhere, maybe in here. Okay, let's pop all this away though and see if we can get silk touch of those mushrooms. Oh yeah, we also have 25 blaze rods, which is heaps. Dragon fight, maybe? No, it's a bit too soon. Okay, let's try to get silk touch though. I want it for mushroom related things, but I also want it for stone. So it'd probably be good on a pickaxe and an axe if we can which I do doubt it. We're just checking what it gives us on iron. Oh, fortune. I think when we decorate the portal, it'd be cool to do it out of stone bricks and stuff, like kind of like this. But we really can't keep smelting cobble because we are running out of coal. Should we do a little reroll? Let's do it. Fortune still, <gasps> silk touch. Let's go, what is our pickaxe gonna give us? Silk touch as well. And I guess the pickaxe is priority. Okay, well, we nearly ran out of lapis here. I guess no to the axe for now. But I think we are going to start working on gathering materials to design our nether portal. I'm thinking just a kind of ruined circular design, maybe, if we can manage it. So we'll want lots of stone with our new pickaxe, but I also want to hop back in and grab some little decorations. Oh, skeleton. The blaze are blazing too. I definitely want more of these. So I went around collecting mostly mushrooms and stuff for them to grow on. Also, I saw this giant jellyfish. It didn't seem to be aggressive. It was very cool. And then we headed back home. Next, I got straight into resource gathering for stone to decorate our nether portal. And now we have a bunch of stone and stone bricks. I would like some of them to be mossy, so it'd be good if we could get some more vines or moss. But also because we're going with this mushroom theme, if we go to our map, oh, we might need to go outside. We can't decide if we're outdoors or in a cave right now. But since I was wanting to use some of these and we have silk touch now, we could also get some mushroom blocks from the dark oak forest. I think they look really good in this texture pack. Oh yes, there's one up here. Yeah, so we need a boat up the river and to the west. And all this can go away for safekeeping. Okay, let's go. Dark oak forest and vines, hopefully. Okay, let's see. This will probably be annoying to break. Oh, it's actually not that bad, even though the tool you're meant to use is an axe. Aren't these blocks just the coolest with this texture pack though? I love them so much. We've got to use these. Also, I don't know if you can see on the mini map very clearly, but in the ocean, there are so many mobs. It's actually crazy. But also because they're like skeletons, they break the boats. You kind of can't stop moving or you get your boat broken. Okay, let's go see real quick. Look at these guys. They've got like coral on them. Oh, is that a whale? Is that a shark? Okay, I I don't know about being here. Oh, oh, there he is. The ocean is terrifying. I don't think I want to be here anymore. What? Is a floating island. Oh, it's full of ores. It's got diamonds in it. Do I have to pull it all the way up? There's bad guys down there. Oh, they're right here. Just kidding. Okay, maybe if we go from all the way over here. That one gave us two. Anything else? We've got, we don't need lapis. We're gonna fortune that. Bane of arthropods. Oh, we don't really need that. Okay, I think we're done here. We have an iron farm, so we don't need the iron. Oh, we've really flooded this. I guess I can just, Wee. Oh dear, that is such a big mess. What have I done? Let's just ignore it and leave. It 
it's exactly what I envisioned, although it is very hard to make a portal look circular. I was thinking we could have hidden the purple a bit more with the stone, but then the corners poke out the top. And then it's really not a circle anymore. But I think the mushrooms turned out so cool, so these are made from calcite walls, and obviously the mushroom blocks we collected. Then we have this slightly nethery feature, these two plants that we got. They're called feather ferns. And some of the big mushrooms coming out the top as well as all of these adorable little ones. Then this is coarse dirt so eventually we can path to, I don't know, wherever we're going. We haven't actually built anything over here so we'll see. I think our portal's looking so cute though, I think it's just visible from over here as well. Through the trees a little bit. But now that we've checked out the nether, built our portal, decorated it and we also kind of conquered that fortress, we got all the blaze rods. I think that will be all for today. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.